Hello friends, welcome to MacLab School. In this video, we are going to simulate model predictive control of a switch reluctance motor. Uh, the same model is available for download in the link given in the description. If you want, you can download it and you can use it for your purpose. Let us get into the simulation. So this is the model uh, uh, which we are going to simulate. Uh, so here uh, we are going to implement MPC uh, for uh, current control of uh, uh, slip uh, switch reluctance motor. Uh, so in this model we have a model predictive control controller at the outer loop and at the inner loop we have hysteresis controller. Okay. Uh, so actually what we are doing here is we are just sensing the uh, speed of the motor also the current. The speed is measured uh, for the control of outer loop and uh, the current is measured for inner loop control. Uh, so here we have the speed uh, and the speed is com uh, converted to uh, radians per second and then it is integrated uh, with the help of uh, this discrete time integrator and then it is uh, divided by 60. Uh, the working of this model is explained in uh, another video uh, which was published earlier uh, with current control of uh, switch reluctance motor if you want you can refer that video as well so uh, here we have the uh, model predictive controller the input of the model predictive controller uh, is the speed actual speed and we need to uh, feed in the reference speed as well so if there are any other uh, uh, disturbances we can include that as well but here uh, I have uh, I have not included any disturbances so I have put 0 here and the reference speed is uh, 1000 rpm and uh, the MPC controller was designed earlier so I have used the already designed controller uh, MPC1 So it is available in the data file. Okay. So this is the model predictive controller, and this is the transfer function of the model. Okay. So let us run this simulation now. Some of time has to be entered. TMC equal to two e power minus six. So, so the simulation model is running now, it is compiling. Started to run. Yes, it is settling at thousand RPM. Okay, the model is running. So as you can see, the uh, error will be very very less in the case of model predictive controller. Also, the overshoot will be very very less. So as you can see, uh, the speed is getting set settled exactly at thousand RPM. This is the motor model which I have used here. 
let's say 8 by 6 uh, switch reluctance motor and these are the values of stator resistance inertia friction inductance values in an unaligned and aligned states This is the speed. This is the torque. Torque developed by SRM. And these are the stator voltages. I mean stator currents. So to uh, develop the MPC controller, we need to have the transfer function of the model initially. Uh, since we have uh, uh, power electronic switches uh, like IGBTs and MOSFETs in the converter, we cannot implement MPC or we cannot tune the MPC directly with the help of, uh, uh, I mean, uh, model, I mean, uh, power electronic switches. So if you find any power electronic switches in the model, we need to go for the transfer function model. Here we have the asymmetric uh, bridge converter. So with this asymmetric converter, we cannot uh, tune MPC. So for that, we have to uh, model the uh, transfer function initially for this model. And uh, the MPC has to be tuned uh, correspondingly. Then only we can uh, implement MPC here. So I will show you the transfer function of the model. So I am stopping the simulation now. This is the transfer function of the model which I have shown you. So this transfer function along with this model, this model is available for download in the link given in the description. If you want you can download it and use it. Okay. Uh, please subscribe our channel and uh, uh, hit like button. Thank you.